que você vai querer ser uma de nós. Ah, quem não conhece essa música, não viveu, não assistiu as nossas fadinhas mais amadas do mundo, que agora viraram uma série live action da Netflix. Que se você não assistiu, já pode maratonar, que você vai se surpreender com Fate, Clube das Winx. A gente vai ter um papo com os protagonistas, a gente falou sobre a segunda temporada. Será que na segunda temporada vai ter a Flora e a Tecna? Hum, será que elas vão contar com a gente essa música? Sei que você vai querer ser uma de nós. Dá só uma olhada no nosso papo, que a equipe do Gloss.com bateu com as nossas fadas Winx da Netflix. Dá só uma olhada. Your first year is all about the element you were born with. This is something you'll learn your first day in class. Fairy magic. Holy shit. Is linked to emotion. You focus, you learn, you grow. Eventually the answers will come. Girls, how are you? Good, thank Good. you. How are you? you? I'm great, thank you. So just a little thing I have to say. I have five questions and five of you. So I'll leave it up to you to decide We'll answer each one of them, okay? Whoa, so, okay? First of all, I had no doubt that Fate would become number one on Netflix. Um, and it did in so many countries, including mine. Um, here in Brazil, the Wings Club was a big hit back then. Um, did you guys watch um, the cartoon as kids? And if so, who, which character would you guys relate to the most? So I didn't watch it, but I knew of it. Uh, because my younger sisters were obsessed with Winx, so we always had it on in the house. Um, I knew kind of, I, roughly, um, who the characters were. Um, and I think I, I, well, Aisha, I think, is called Layla in the, in the cartoons. And yeah, I think I connected with her um, because I guess she represents, she looked like me. So, yeah. So the live action is not as glittery, glittery and bubbly as the cartoon. It's a bit darker and more intense, and it also brings up um, a lot of real life problems. What do you hope fans of the original version takes away from this new version of the show? I mean, I think the the I don't know the element that really resonates with me is just the the realness of it all, like, and how it deals with actual I don't know teenage problems I think that's really special because it doesn't just deal with the the good it actually shows the good the bad the ugly and I think that that is very important for young men and women to see and um just I guess resonate with at their age because I know that at my when I was a teenager I was going through kind of what all these girls are going through and um I think it's really special that we get to be a part of it and show, you know, um, I guess I say a younger audience, but all, all ages kind of also what female friendship can look like, you know, and, and how women can come together and be a force to reckon with. And um, yeah, I mean, I, there are a lot of different things that you can take from it, but I, I definitely took that one of, that was one of the things I took from it, but yeah, if that answers your question. <laughs> Yes, it does. Um, so the audience may have had a different perspective of what they would see in the show. This time around, for example, we don't have winged girls in shiny outfits flying around. And we also don't see some characters like Flora and Tecna. Um, was it hard? Was it a challenge for you to try and meet with the viewers' expectations and also introduce new things to this fantasy world? I think it's... Oh, go on, go on. No, go. please, please, you go. <laughs> okay um yeah I think it's always going to be a challenge when there is something so iconic about the original characters but again like this is it, it's a lot more real like I speaking for myself I don't have the body of a cartoon character who's gonna be uh, dressed in really skimpy outfits and I don't think that a lot of people have the confidence to wear those outfits especially at that age so I think being like this is not It wouldn't be fair, it wouldn't do justice to the reality of being a teenager if people were mm. wearing those outfits, um, which is a real shame because obviously they're iconic and we love to see that. But I think kind of having 
uh, more nuance and kind of a more realistic tone to the show is really important uh, for portraying what it's like to be 16, 17. I agree. Um, now a bit of a deep question. Do you guys believe in fate or do you think people can control their own destinies? Ooh. I think um, people can control their destiny. I think um, if you believe something's going to happen to you in the future, it's great, but you have to make it happen yourself so you can control your own destiny, I think. Amazing. That's so amazing. the series ends with a huge cliffhanger. I want to know what you guys expect to see happening in a possible second season. Well, that would be left to me. Um, I uh, wish we had some control over what happens uh, if we get a series two, because I think we'd, uh, we'd between us, we'd, we'd come up with some pretty cool ideas. Um, but what, what I hope will happen is um, that we will get some of the characters that people missed um, in this series. I think, mm -hmm. you know, it's particularly important that we get a flora in. Um, so I think that would be top of the list for me. Um, and just that we all get to have more scenes together and hopefully some more adventures and some more romance. It'd be great. I'm very excited about that, by the way. So now I have just a little game that I want to make with you guys. Um, I selected five things <laughs> all of your characters do for the series, and I want to know who between you guys would be more likely to doing them in real life. Okay, great. so you just say the name of the person. Um, who would be more likely to break the rules and become friends with the enemy? <laughs> Who's the traitor? <laughs> who's, the, who's the rat of the group? <laughs> do we all have an enemy? Like, do we all have like a... I, I think none of us would do it on purpose. I think the real question is who would accidentally do that? Yeah, Abby. 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 Yeah. <laughs> We'd all be like, oh, no, no, Abby, that's a demon. Don't be <laughs> no, no, He said he's not. <laughs> You just you don't know him. <laughs> yeah. I know, Abby, he killed someone. No, he did. No. Um, I would, yeah, I would. That 100%. I have, like, very little street smarts, so. <laughs> and who would be more Very like bad at reading people. <laughs> I don't know how I'm still alive, honestly. <laughs> and who would be more likely to confront a bully? Oh, I think we've all got that in us. Mm, right yeah. yeah yeah I feel like yeah amazing who would be more likely to reveal a friend's secret in order to try and protect them oh, oh in order ooh. to protect them a twist oh I can see that I can see that from you Elliot because I can see the logic of being like I care about this person so much that I'm going to do the right thing for them, even though they don't quite know it's the right thing for them yet. Mm. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to take that, but I'll, I'll take it as a good thing. No, I mean, it's in like the, you know the highest good, <laughs> like do you know justice. What I mean? so, yeah, yeah, exactly. Because yeah. you are very, you are very much like, uh, uh, that is not right, and you will step in. I've seen it. You're like mm -hmm. hell no. So like, <laughs> I think yeah, and it's just like it, you, it's just instinctual for you. I feel like, mm. and Thank it's you guys. it's a very yeah. You're very justice driven, which I love. Awesome. Yeah, I'd say, yeah. Who would be more likely to leave home as a teenager and not tell their parents of their whereabouts? Alicia. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew that was coming for me as well. <laughs> Did that happen actually? Uh, a few times, but. <laughs> and last but not least, who would be more likely to date their best friend's brother? <laughs> how do you haven't had one yet? So, uh... oh yeah, that's why it's you're only fair. Say, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing, um, girls! I know that you are all big karaoke fans, so I want to propose something fun. Um, everyone here in Brazil is obsessed with the original opening song of the show and they made an actual track out of it. And Netflix Brazil released the TikTok challenge so that people can dance to it. So what I want to know is if one of you guys, or maybe all of you, would try and sing one of the lines to the song in Portuguese. Sure. Why not? 
in Portuguese. Yes, well it's done. only one line. One line, yeah. So it's sei que você vai querer ser uma de nós. Sei que você vai querer ser uma de nós. What's the other one? What's the second one? Vai querer ser. Vai querer ser. Vai querer ser. Vai querer ser. Imaginos. Yay. <laughs> That's great. I'm pretty strong, guys. Imaginos. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Girls, thank you so much. That was amazing. I love the show, by the way. It's a huge success. And I really hope we have second season. Um, do you guys want to say something to your Brazilian fans before we go? Hi, Brazil. Thank you for supporting us and showing so much love for the show. We appreciate you all. And um, we hope we've done these characters justice. Amazing. Yes, and you guys are so, so vocal and it does not go unnoticed. We see all of your comments and your messages and all of that. Um, so thank you, thank you, thank you for all of the support and for all the love. Amazing girls. Thank you so much. It was a pleasure. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Ai, que fofa as nossas Winks. Quero ver muito mais de Stella, de Terra, de Bloom. Maravilhosas. O que será que essa segunda temporada pode trazer pra gente, hein? Tô muito mais apaixonada por elas e gostei dessa versão brasileira da música, hein? Ó, exclusividade de Gloss.com. Parabéns, equipe! Então, olha, vão assistir Fate, a saga das Winks, na Netflix. Depois você me conta o que vocês acharam. Deixe seu comentário aqui. E vai compartilhando pros amigos, vai que você vira uma fada, uma fada do desejo, uma fada da lua, fada do mar, fada do sol, fada de tudo. Beijo pra vocês, compartilha, comenta, como é que é? Sininho, a ah, fada sininho, a ah, louca. Beijo pra vocês. Até a próxima, beijo. There's a war on the horizon. This is what we've been training for. We can help our friend. What are you thinking of doing? I'm here. I always knew your path wouldn't be like everyone else's. But I can't wait to see who you become.